Hello everybody, it's the King back here with another video, and today guys, we're back with another episode of LEGO Marvel Super Heroes. Now, uh, before we start, just three things to quickly address. First of all, as you guys can probably hear from my voice, I am, uh, pretty sick. Uh, so, I I'm gonna try it on the sneeze on camera, I'm gonna be, uh, pausing here and there whenever I need to sneeze. So, just letting you guys know if you see any random, uh, cuts or pauses in between the videos, that is why. Um... And my voice might sound a little different, a little deeper, maybe a little more uh, gravelly. That's kind of, again, why I'm a little sick. So just kind of ignore it if you can. My apologies. Uh, there's nothing really I can do about it. Um, on the other hand, we've kind of been uh, <laughs> criticizing this game quite a bit in the past few videos about how there's just a bunch of nonsense characters and stuff. So I've got to give them credit where credit is due. I just noticed this, and I think it's actually pretty cool, and I want to point it out just while I hear out, well... Oh my god, just while I was here in the waiting screen, I kind of noticed it, and I was like, okay, yeah, I definitely got to point that out once I actually start recording. So, if you go ahead and actually target a missile with Tony, if you can see, like, a missile, like, rocket launcher actually pops out, and, and that golden thing is actually a missile. Like, it's actually got a missile in there with, like, the whole, like, holster and everything, which is something I did not notice before, because... Even if they just ha had this man point his hand, like, they really didn't need to add the rocket launcher as well, and I don't think anyone would have really noticed the difference, or at the very least, I haven't noticed the difference, but honestly, it's still a really neat feature that they added in there, and I'm actually really kind of pleasantly surprised by the little details that go into this game. Uh, for example, another uh, little detail, you know what I mean, we're starting off this episode with a little bit of positivity, something we don't usually do. Usually we're trashing this game for the horrible characters it's got, so you know what, let's, let's just start with a little positivity. Uh, actually, I don't think, yeah, no, Human Torch would be a better uh, example for this, so hold on, let me just, uh, where is he, where is Human Torch, da 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 da, uh, there he is. So, as you can see, Venom is perfectly fine, and I actually showed uh, showed this off in a different episode because I didn't even know about it. I, we figured this li feature out literally on camera, but as you guys can see, he's perfectly fine. However, when Johnny flames on, yeah, look at this, Venom actually starts backing up. Now, you have to remember, this game was released after LEGO Batman 2, and LEGO Batman 2 had the exact same animation for Superman whenever he came into contact with Kryptonite, but it's still so sort of like... Look at that, it's such a neat feature that they actually allowed Venom to be affected not only by, like, physical flames and, like, obstacles, obviously, but, like, by actual characters as well. Now, speaking of, I'm actually a little kind of... I want to see if he... if it's, like, flame beams as well. So, for example, Pyro doesn't have any fire currently being exhibited. This is a flame beam. No, Venom is not going to react to just a beam. It has to actually be, like, a physical flame source. So, like... Just using a fire beam near him isn't gonna make him back up. Although, it would be cool if they added that as well. But anyway, I just, I thought it was a re uh, some really cool features we could point out there. Kind of have some positivity going on. Um, but yeah, anyway, we're gonna go ahead and continue doing red bricks just like I mentioned in the last episode. We're going over to, uh, over to the gym where, basically over here, uh, I, I guess, never mind, we're actually in the air. Let me just go ahead and do this real quick. Bunch of easy studs, honestly. Uh, I know a lot of people might just skip this and just jump straight down or whatever, and I, I used to do so, but then, like, look at how much studs we get. Although it's not, like, crazy at this point in the game, but, like, it definitely helps. It's just a good amount of studs. Um, so, as you guys can see, hold on, actually, let's fly here. So, yeah, this is this, we're gonna go over here to this gym area to do this red brick, so, uh, let's go ahead and do that. I'm trying to be a little smoother with the pauses, just to make them, like, not as conspicuous and not as, like, video disrupting. Because, uh, <laughs> fortunately, if, for those who don't know, for those who are new to the channel, um, because I, I know we've been getting crazy, like, amount of subscribers lately. So, for those who are new to the channel, um, <laughs> I am a person with what you would uh, call a weak immune system. So, I get sick much more often than regular people, and when I do get sick, I get sick... Um, much more, like, severely than other people as well. So, for instance, whenever I have a cold, it's the equivalent to a normal person, like, getting a flu. And whenever I've got the flu, uh, I don't even want to talk about it, frankly. But, yeah, it's, it's, it's actually pretty bad. But, um, so, yeah. Like, so most people will get a cold, you will sometimes won't even notice. For me, it's it's pretty evident. And so, uh, I'm, I'm gonna try to keep the amount of po Oh, hold on, what the hell's going on with the volume? Uh, uh there we go. Alright, yeah. My bad, guys. I think the volume is a little, uh, played down there, but there you go. You wanna... Huh. Oh, we're fighting Blob, actually, which is kind of... <laughs> that's kind of... 
You know what? I'm actually surprised they added this man in the game. But at the same time, I'm just... Uh, like, like, I want to be positive, right? And I want to be like... Like, I want to bring some positivity to the day. And I'm like... But seriously, Blob? Are you kidding me? Bro, come on. Oh. Like, out of all the characters they gotta add it, they went with Blob? Why? Uh, okay, there we go. Uh, hold on, there we go. Alright, Threat Mills, uh... I have no idea what we're doing, I'm just gonna be frank. Uh, yeah, okay. See, I thought this was a, 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 a thing, but when I tried to use it, it didn't work. Alright, what are we... Oh, are we making a cake? Is that what we're doing? Uh... I would assume so, except this thing can't be... Huh. Okay, hold on. Let's, uh... Yeah, let's just go with some destruction pulses here. Alright. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, so we're trying to create a cake, basically. That's gotta go on here. Come on. Come on. Alright. Nope. Really? That didn't slot in? There we go. Finally. And then we can just move this over here. Come on. There we go. And then, uh, where are we putting this? Okay, yeah. I literally just guessed. For, I didn't even know we were, where we were supposed to put it. But I just saw the stadium and I was like, might as well. Wow, this is, this is evil. This is, <laughs> man's out here trying to lose some weight. You don't gotta, oh, this is actually evil. Okay. Oh, I see. And this is a large cola that we should be able to. Is the cola not complete? Is that why we can't move it? Uh, hold on. So the coal is done. We've also got to make this like carrot banana thing up at the top. Yeah, sorry about that. So as I was saying, we've got to make this like carrot banana thing up at the top. But I just don't know where we're even supposed to find the ingredients for that thing. Um, huh, I don't know. I, I mean, there's some chicken and stuff up here, but that's not really what we're looking for in this particular case. Uh. I mean, obviously, chicken is always good to have around, but <laughs> well, that's not for, yeah, I don't think Gene, yeah, okay, I didn't think so, okay, so this definitely isn't part of the, that's a, a red brick exclusive thing, but I just, huh. Oh my god, I didn't know the stadium bounces, anyway, uh, we should be able to move this, but we can't, so I just, I don't know what I'm missing here. Oh, is it because it's not filled? Do we have to find a way to fill it? Hold on. Uh Huh. I'm just... What was the point of that? Oh, you know what? Okay, it left some pieces behind. Okay, alright. Uh, so we're trying to build something here. I see. I see. I see. Okay. Alright, see, now I see. I get it now. Okay, see, so this is where it goes. All right, and then the soda. I see. Huh. I'd like to blame this on me being sick, and that's the reason I, I'm not, like, I didn't figure it out immediately, but frankly, no. Just because, like, like, look at how big this puzzle, this room is, with so many things to do. How are you supposed to know that you, you've got to do it in that order? Because it was the third thing first. It was the cake first. Why would you then assume that it's got to be, like, the first thing second? Like, that makes no sense. All right, uh, I'm assuming we still gotta fill uh, fill up this drink because we can't move it with telekinesis yet. So, uh, I'm trying to look where we would even be able to fill it up with. Uh, maybe this thing. Hold on, fly, Gene, please. All right, I forgot Gene can't fly because he sucks. All right, hold on. Uh, I don't know. Maybe maybe if we break the stuff up here, we can like recreate a uh. Yeah, oh, nope, okay. I saw the yellow and red thing, and I thought we were actually getting some uh, building blocks, but nope. Huh, okay. Uh. Oh, actually, yes, we were getting some. Okay, cool. All right, so yes, we were actually getting some building pieces. My initial guess was correct. It's just... Is this how we're gonna fill up this thing? Wow, this is the dumbest way to fill up a... <laughs> Bro, this is... Yo, this is at when you're at like Chuck E. Cheese or like like a place with free drinks or whatever, right? And you just, you really want that extra bit of drink in that. So so you put the lid on, but you just keep filling it up till it's fully, fully filled. 
And then you pull the lid on and like it starts sp spilling and you're like, oh, duck. oh no. <laughs> oh god. Bro, I can't be the only one who did that. Whenever I got a place that had free drinks, I would always fill it up to the very, very brim. And then I would put on the lid. And because it's so filled up, the lid would actually cause it to spill a little bit. And I'd, and I'd be looking at the cup like, no, not my precious drink. And it's like, bro, you get free refills. What are you doing with your life? <laughs> Bro, I swear I used to do that shit, bro. Oh, hold on, what? Hey, yo, so we have Gene Phoenix and Dark Phoenix? All right. All right, not repetitive at all. <laughs> like, frankly, Phoenix and Dark Phoenix are basically the same thing. Like, if we if we just go keep it 100, they're literally the same person. I don't know what you... Like, yeah, I get one of them is evil, one of them is normal, but, like, come on now. Come on, hold on. Uh, th this is definitely isn't the person I chose. I mean, like, come on now. Uh, come on. Really? Really? Was the color switch enough to make it a DLC? Come on. I didn't know that Phoenix was in the game. I thought the only way to get Phoenix was with the DLC. Why would you do this, Marvel? Or, or whoever's behind these LEGO games, frankly. Why would you? I tried to be so positive in the beginning. I really, really did. I tried to kind of give some positivity. But you literally copied the same skin and just turned it red. What the hell? And then you made people pay money for it. I'm just... It's the same... It's not even, like, a little bit of, like, aesthetic flair. Even the AFK animations are the exact same. This is just... This is just dumb. Alright, we are back. Yep, we are... Well, hold on. Are we still recording? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, cool. Sorry, guys. So, yeah, we're here at the free play mode. Uh, <laughs> uh, I decided to stop ranting and just get right in back into the video. But, honestly, it's just so stupid. Alright. Let's go ahead and save Stan Lee. Alright, there we go. Uh, there we go. So we saved Stan. We still have to... Hold on. I'm trying to think. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so the tech panel over here. Uh, Reed... He, he, he has Reed Richards' abilities. That's not what I meant to do, but okay. Uh, oh my god. Cap, you gotta move, bro. You, you really, you, you really gots to move. There we go. Alright. And then we're gonna hack over here, which I'm assuming this is gonna be the character token. Yeah, uh, nope, this is the red brick, alright, I got you, I got you, alright, uh, huh, alright, so the next thing we're looking for is where the, uh, character token's going to be, uh, let me see here, because I didn't notice any other sort of, like, secret puzzle or whatever, so we need to find out where the red brick is gonna be, I mean, sorry, the character token's gonna be before we end off this episode, I mean, before we, like, leave this little area, oh, there it is, there it is, I see, Yep, yeah, see, the Super Scroll is just so useful, like, it's not even funny. Alright, there we go. Let's see who we get out of this little red brick mission. Oh, Wolverine no, with the cowl on, alright. Uh, why would they make it so long if they weren't even gonna place, like, uh, at least a purple stud in the end? But okay, whatever. Alright, you know what, I'm not actually mad about that, this is, this is kinda cool. Um, alright. Let's go here, let's go like that, and then, you know what, sure, we'll play with regular Phoenix, because there's such a difference, you know what I mean? You you wouldn't want to get them confused or mixed up, nah, 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 definitely not the same character, and anyone who other says otherwise, nah, you guys are, you guys are, bro, they're literally the same, I'm actually kind of mad, I'm not gonna lie, I'm mad, I'm actually a little mad, I'm not gonna lie, like, what, what, what would you guys, oh my god, like, I really tried to be positive. I was like, hey, look at these little details that they added in. You know what I mean? We, we don't have to be negative all the time. And then, like, it was as if the game gods heard me and were like, oh, yeah, yeah. So you try to be positive today, huh? Are you sure about that? <laughs> you sure that's what you want to do today? <laughs> Swear to God, bro. Man, see, you guys should learn a lesson from this. Never be positive. I think that's the lesson this game is trying to teach. Yeah, yeah. You should never, ever be positive. <laughs> Uh, alright, uh, let's go like that. Let's get this filled up. Uh, nope, that's not what I'm- Okay, sure! Sure, Gene. Whatever you say. Gene's really trying to be the star of the show today. Like, I didn't even switch to her. I walked up to the water cannon, pressed the switch button so that he could get in, and... It's not even filling up. There we go, finally. Like, bro, Gene's really trying to- <laughs> She's really trying to steal the show today. Alright. Hold on, we gotta, uh... Yeah, we gotta break this thing first. Uh, hold on. So, let's go like this. Do that. And then do that. Alright, that's not enough. Do that as well. And then do this as well. There we go. And then we've gotta go ahead and destroy this thing here. Alright. 
Come on. Yep, we gotta wait for that to pop out. And then, uh, there's one more thing we've gotta destroy. I'm trying to remember what it was. Uh, da 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 It definitely wasn't this, but you know what? Let's go ahead and build this up uh, quickly anyway. Uh, there we go. Just go ahead and destroy these things, and then we can go like that. Honestly, telekinetic building is so cool. It's, it's, I really like the animation for it. Once we get speed building, it'll be even cooler. But until then... Alright. So, uh, hold on. Ah. Uh, I'm trying to remember how we get this guy off. I, I think it's with the cake, but I just... Uh, pause. Definitely pause. Uh, anyway. <laughs> anyway. A uh, poor choice of words. Uh, <laughs> poor choice of words later. There we go. Uh, let's do this. Now, I'm actually curious about something, okay? What if instead of the drink first, we put, like, this thing first? Is it gonna, like, allow us to do this? Or you know what it is, so it doesn't have to be in order. It just doesn't matter in that case. Okay, I see. I see, I see. Okay. So, yeah, this doesn't actually have to be in order. It just... It just has to be done, basically. You can do it in whatever order you want. Alright, I see. The reason the first time we couldn't use the drink immediately is because it wasn't filled up. That must be why. I kind of found it strange that they had a, such, such a weird order. It was 3, 1, 2. And I was like, why would they do that? But now I realize it was just me being dumb. <laughs> well, there we go. That was actually... That was like the fastest re uh, free, pro uh, free play red brick we've ever done. That was actually crazy. And it was all thanks to the Phoenix. I swear to God. I'm so bad. I'm actually a little pissed. I'm not gonna lie. Why would they- Bro, I'm not even mad because I spent the money for it. You feel me? I'm I'm just assuming that back when this game was released, the DLC was a way more expensive than it is now. You've got to remember, it was like a buck for me. It was like a dollar, two dollars or something, right? And it was on sale. So, like, for me, it was nothing. It literally cost nothing to get, to get Dark Phoenix. But I'm assuming at the time this game came out, like, this, this was at least five, ten bucks DLC. That's at least what I'm assuming, right? So, they really sold uh, just a reskin, recolored character for, like, five, ten bucks. Bro, because none of the other characters in the DLC are worth anything other than uh, Odin, because he's the only character with infinite lightning. And even that's not true. Because because you know what I figured out? Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. Oh, wow. Isn't that crazy? Doom has lightning. Like, even, even then, Odin means abs and... Look at this. Oh, actually, hold on. I thought Doom could fly because it would make sense for him to be able to fly. But nope, why would you allow Doom to fly? <laughs> anyway, <laughs> it makes no sense Doom can't fly, but whatever. Sure, infinite lightning is still a plus. Like, so in that case, Odin doesn't mean, like, Odin has no utility, right? Because even his one ability of infinite lightning, Doom can already do. And you unlock Doom just by playing through the story mission. And then... Dark Phoenix is just a reskin, so please tell me why anyone should ever get these. These characters suck. Like, Thanos is cool, but even then, he's literally worthless. Like, he can't do anything. He can't even fly. He, like, that's it. He has some blasts, and that's it. That, that's the only thing he can do. Like, his design isn't even cool. It's not, like, like he doesn't have any cool, like, like hold, on, hold on, hold on. Look at this, look at this, look at this, okay? Hold on. Let me, let me show you what I mean. Look at the print work on the, this big thing and compare it to Thanos. You see the scales, you see this sort of shaft going like uh, across this. Hold on, let me, let me, do I have a targeter? No. Uh, damn it, I really wish I had like a third uh, character. Okay, hold on, hold on. You see, you see like in his chest, like that little like, um, I, I really wish I had a mouse right now so I could point this out. But he has like this little strap going down his chest. He has these like uh, cool like... Um, I was gonna call them the horns, but not really horns. They're like these weird, cool spikes, like extruding from his arms and stuff. Like, and look at Thanos. Thanos doesn't even have like like they didn't even try to like put print work on his armor to make it look like it's scale, like um, like it's plate armor or whatever. This is just literally a blob. This is just a gold blob. This isn't even like why would you get the DLC? I just oh my god. All right, you know what? I'm gonna I'm gonna end this video before it turns into a 35 minute rant. Um, <laughs> I hope you guys did enjoy this episode. If you did, hit the like button, or at least reskin it red and then sell it for a dollar. I'm sorry. I, I I'm sorry, but I really, <laughs> it's just so stupid. It's just so so dumb. Oh my god, Dark Phoenix was the only character in the entire DLC 
who is worth anything, and I find out she's a reskin. I'm... God, oh, I'm so disappointed. Anyway, I'm so disappointed in this game. Um... I do hope you guys enjoyed this episode. If you did, hit the like button. If you guys want to talk to me or your fellow viewers, use the comment section down below. I always respond to all comments, and or at the very least, I always read them. Sometimes I don't really really have a response, so I just read them, give it like a little like or whatever. I just kind of ghost. But um, frankly, like some of the discussions we viewer, we and I, I've been having with the viewers, yeah, that that's yep, that's proper grammar, whatever. Some of the discussions I've been having with uh, you guys, the viewers, have been really interesting, really fun. I'm actually really enjoying them. So if you guys want to get in on those discussions, and just kind of speak your mind about anything, this game or even something else included, uh, go ahead and use the comment section down below. And if you guys want to subscribe to this channel, we are growing every day, and I would really appreciate it if you guys come on along and enjoy the run and enjoy the show. You know what I mean? Uh, that's all though. I do hope you all had a wonderful day. If you haven't, I hope it turns into a great and a wonderful day, and I will see you all tomorrow. Peace out, everyone.